Come on, come on. Surprise! What the Rob Nelson here from Charlotte, North Carolina. And hello from Stockholm, Sweden. I'm Jonas Stenstrom. Exciting. Last year, we started 52 things. It's 52 things. 52 things! 52 things. One new thing that you can try out every week to become a better photographer or filmmaker. <laughs> yeah, get all of it. Get the tail. <laughs> Suck get it the... up. <laughs> get, get him with the water. Oh, that's fantastic. So it's time for us to wrap up this project and move on to new things. And also, we want to share a few things with you that have been on our minds. Important bits first. This channel is not really going to change in any way, except we're going to be making videos every other week instead of every week. It means that the name 52 Things it doesn't make sense anymore. <laughs> It's, it's really only 26 things if we're doing it on a year basis, right? So the name is going to go back kind of how it was, Science Filmmaking Tips. It makes sense. People instantly know what that name is. And a lot of you recommended that for SEO, for search engine optimization. So we're taking your advice. Secondly, I'm hosting a new series on Untamed Science, all about biodiversity. Things you might not have known about owls. So much scarier with a blindfold on. Do you find the coastal redwoods? That's the channel right there. You can click on that i card if you want to follow along. In fact, I encourage all of you to do that. And stick around to the end if you want to see how to get one of these. And I'll be hosting another channel where I'll be putting out content in the future as well. If you want to follow that along, please go ahead and check this link out. I might not be able to put out videos first thing in the next year because of basically my life right now. But uh, if you click the subscribe button and the notification button right now, you will get a ping whenever a video comes out and I would love to see you there as well. We wanted to make sure that you understood why we were making these channels. First of all, this channel, this behind the scenes channel was never supposed to be the main channel, two and three. And there is a whole technique that goes in sending a GoPro to space should you go to film school. It was like all the extra stuff that we were throwing out there. The science stuff was always our main stuff. I finally made it into the forest. And that is cold stunned sea turtles. Invasive plants. Conia. Hoster's curse. Lots of I'm going to try out an airboat. But a few years ago, a couple of the videos took off. How to make stop motion. In fact, quite a few of them took off. The whole channel started to take off. Through how you might photograph the northern lights. And we figured, well, maybe this is what we're meant to do. Maybe this should be the job job that will allow us to do our passion, which is doing the science filmmaking. Now, the problem with that is it was unsustainable because even with YouTube bringing in some money through ads and with our patrons and with all the gear that we would drop. And then this happened and break along the year. Um, I don't think we were even breaking even. <laughs> and, and we're okay doing things that are unsustainable if it's our passion project. And I think what we realized it's, is that we were doing all of this because we wanted to help teach people to do what we are doing. And we are still gonna do that just at a lower level because right now I think there are a lot of people who can teach you how to use a camera. They can teach you how to edit. They can teach you how to use Photoshop. There's a lot of really good people that that is their life goal. And so what's the point of repeating that? There, there really is no point. We're gonna try to focus more on the science filmmaking side of things, which is a little bit more of a niche market. We understand that. And then we're gonna spend the rest of our time dedicated to doing our real passion, which is talking about nature. That is a leatherback sea turtle. There are endless stories and nobody is telling all of those stories that need to be made. I really feel that that is part of our true calling. That is why we're each taking a separate channel because that seems to be what works on YouTube, especially because Jonas and I are thousands of miles away. And I want to take a minute to be really honest with you as well. This year has been really difficult for me, actually been one of the hardest years of my life. Uh, don't get me wrong, there's been a lot of great moments as well. One, of course, being that one year ago exactly, I had my second kid. This guy who is amazing and a power package and so full of energy. And of course, I also have my daughter who is now four and a half years old and loves a little brother. But in the past, I would spend pretty much every waking hour trying to fulfill my passion and help this planet. But with everything that's been going on this year, uh, raising the kids, health issues, moving houses, I, everything else as well, I, I just haven't been able to make it all work. And now my family needs me to earn enough to support the family, which is something you have to do when you have a family, of course. Um, and on top of that, I haven't been able to make any videos hardly last year on my true passion, which is wildlife. So 
Rob and I really wanted to make this channel uh, our full-time job and fully sustainable, but we haven't unfortunately found the funding to do so. So I've decided I need to decrease this a little bit, uh, earn enough money to support my family, and then also spend more time on my passion, and that is wildlife films. And then on the side, of course, we're gonna start putting out more videos on this channel as well. We just need to decrease it a little bit. And finally, for those of you who are supporting us, we are gonna be changing things up a little bit because in the past, we kind of said there was a little bit of a hodgepodge of what you're supporting. Sometimes it's science filmmaking, sometimes it's science filmmaking tips and tricks. Now we're splitting it up so that you have a choice. You got the tips and tricks you can support over here, help us make sure that we can be sustainable there. And now, if you wanna help us sustain the science outreach, the education, the conservation films that we're doing, which I think are extremely important and part of our passion, um, you can go over there and that's what these are all about. I have these little drawings that I've made and we're gonna be sending out postcards to anybody who goes over there and donates even at the very smallest level. Thanks everybody for watching. Um, we will see you in a future video.